I was in a kind of an abusive relationship and moving from place to place. And uh, once I got out of that relationship, then I was able to put in for different programs to get housing. A lot of people be saying it ain't no help out there, but you just have to keep looking. So to me, I can fit, you know, a whole lot of things, different programs and different things where, where you can get help if you really need it. You know, sometimes we fall down and it's hard to get up. And I think if you fall and you would come through this program what I can, they would help you. You know, they wouldn't just turn their back on you and send you on about your way out the door. You know, they would at least try to help you to see what you need, you know, and what's really going on in your life. Because sometimes, you know, we, we hide stuff, especially from our families. You know, we don't want them to know. And then sometimes it might be just a little easier to come to ICANN or come and to sit down and talk to somebody that's on the outside. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That they're very friendly and they kind of make me feel like they a different part of my family. Like they're my family too. Because I know like if I can't go to my mom or my sister and them, I can always call somebody up here and maybe have a conversation with them or talk to them or something. I think anybody would be lucky to get into this program. For real, I do. I know I am. I'm blessed with, with that. I've been living in my apartment for five years. Um, I started school off and on trying to get my GED. Just knowing that I don't have to worry about not having a roof over my head and if I fall, you know, they're not just gonna throw me out on my butt. You know, they're gonna still give me a chance, you know, to try to help me, you know, get back up on my feet. So it, it feels good to be able to go home in my own apartment, my own space, do I can.